today I will replace the main board of 6.2 kilowatt Enrin Eco uh, 6200 hybrid inverter. So before replacing the motherboard, I tell you the fault. The fault was the DC side get short because of the dust. So look this uh, filters, even it's look chalk, but the fine particle of the board was the dust was on the board and the DC side get short because most fits are sensitive they are working on the high frequency so it can easily die so look the comparison how much is similarities on 24 volt and 48 volt motherboards both have a pv rating input 6 uh, 6 kilo 6 kilowatt and this one 6.2 kilowatt so these inverter boards have a built-in mppt okay this is a mppt section and this is the DC side and this is the AC side so same here you look uh, if this one so here is the DC bus capacitor this is 48 volt and this is also is MPPT very similar right this one 6.2 kilowatt a hybrid inverter MPPT and this is a 4.2 kilowatt hybrid inverter MPPT and the bus capacitor are same here is the bus capacitors are same let me flip the board so you can see more visually more clearly the similarities okay so here is the DC bus capacitor here is the DC bus capacitor this one is 10,000 UF 63 volt and this one also 10,000 UF 63 volt so the DC bus capacitors are same look the this is SD3525 for uh, switching for the DC side and the charging section AC side so here is the bus capacitors they are also same let's see 470 uf 500 volt and here is the 6.2 kilowatt 470 uf 500 volt they both are very very similar the main core is like this but this one is very big core the thickness is very big this one and other all board is very very similar just the difference is you can see the inductors little bit different here so here is using the IGBT in 6.2 kilowatt is 75 t65 okay and the dc side is sixty five n15 so this is the dc side mosfet this was 48 volt motherboard and this is 24 volt motherboard 4.2 kilowatt 6.2 kilowatt very similar just uh, the core is little bit different this one is bigger core this one is smaller core but DC bus capacitor input are same rating the output DC bus capacitors are also same MPPT functions are same the bus voltage functions are same the uh, computer card the CPU card is definitely different so that both inverter can work without batteries and they both have grid sharing features also so in the uh, 4.2 kilowatt the IGBT is 40 and 65 and the DC side 
82H140. So this is the side by side comparison of 6.2 and 4.2 kilowatt Enrin hybrid inverters. The the downside you can see all is same. This was 4.2 and it's a really heavy 6.2 very very similar so now i will off the camera i will replace the board on this one the damage board i will take out and after that we will test this one In board i replace ready connection all almost ready just only put the front panel and lcd and then we test for test purpose i'm using the power tool batteries 2 in series and one 3s battery in also series so this 5s 5s 10s plus 3s so it's become 13s it is become 48 volt is perfect and here for the pv i will use this rectifier as a uh, rectifier bridge as a dc voltage source so here is our inverter and i will just connect it now because it's already pre-charged so let me on the inverter okay 51.3 is the battery voltage this red light pin is a battery operated 230 volt ac so now i have to test this the pv so this rectifier will work as a PV so let me connect okay so here you can see 320 volt of the PV come and you can see that is go and the charging is begin so this is our uh, you know become PV ok battery ok and now we test the our output voltage using our multimeter now I will test my output voltage so this was the grid input and this is the ok this is the output one here is the output two perfect so everything is work perfect I will off the inverter and battery is also perfect and we are ready to go. I will off the solar first and battery second is take little time to get off. So thus that was for my test purpose. So anyway this inverter is become okay now hopefully it will work well. Thank you very much for watching see you until the next.